Hello friends, today we see about limit test for chloride. So learning objective for these are to know definition for limit test, principle involved in limit test for chloride and procedure for limit test for chloride. Here is a reflection spot, you just pause the video and just Think about which are the different methods which we use for identification of impurity in substance. Yes, you are correct. There are different methods we use for identification of impurity. Like the physical methods, like the physical constant we use for determination of impurity. If the substance is liquid, then we use optical rotation or also the refractive index and also limit test one of the them. So what is limit test? So definition for limit test. Limit tests are quantitative or semi-quantitative tests designed to identify and control small quantities of impurity which are likely to be present in the substance. So, limit test for chloride, we begin. So, this word limit test for chloride indicate you have to identify the chloride impurities in substance. And for this identification of chloride impurities, we use very simple test for getting chloride impurity. So, basic principle involved in limit test for chloride based on the simple reaction between silver nitrate and soluble chloride to obtain silver chloride which is insoluble in dilute nitric acid. Here is the reaction which involved in this. The silver chloride produced in the presence of dilute HNO3 makes the test solution turbid. The extent of turbidity depending upon the amount of chloride present in the substance. The standard solution prepared and compare with test solution. For this limit test for chloride, we use a comparison method. The comparison between the test solution and standard solution. So, procedure for preparation of this solution. Test solution are nothing but the solution we prepared by taking the sample from which you want to identify impurity and standard solution is nothing but the solution in which we use the standard substance which contains the chloride and this standard substance which we use having a known amount of chloride impurities so how to prepare test solution for that you have to take specified substance mostly 1 gram and dissolve it in 10 ml of distilled water then to it add 1 ml of dilute nitric acid and make up the volume up to 50 ml in nestle cylinder after that take one add 1 ml of silver nitrate solution and stir it you will get opalescence if the sample having chloride impurities. For preparation of standard solution, you have to take 1 ml of 0.05845% weight by volume solution of sodium chloride. Then to it add 1 ml nitric acid and make up the volume up to 50 ml in Nestle cylinder. To this add 1 ml of silver nitrate solution and stir it. Opersons get produced. After that, keep aside for 5 minutes and compare the turbidity or opersons produced in test solution and standard solution. If the test solution contains less turbidity than the standard, this indicates the chloride impurities which are present in substance which are within the limit so it complies the test but if your test solution contains maximum imp 
maximum opacity or turbidity than standard this indicate your sample contains the chloride impurities which are beyond the prescribed limit so you discard or you can't use this sample for the further test or further use so here i think you getting about what is limit test and limit test for chloride and how to perform this limit test for chloride thank you thank you very much